Welcome to AmeenAcademy.com. In GMAT, let us do quantitative practice test. Look at this example. For dinner at a restaurant, there are X choices of appetizers, Y plus 1 main courses, and Z choices of desserts. How many total possible choices are there if you choose one appetizer, one main course, and one dessert for your meal? Here, X choice for appetizer, and Y plus 1 main course, and Z choice of dessert. So, one person select one one in each choices. So, therefore, that uh, choice of dessert for your meal is here plus x into y plus 1 into z which is equal x z into y plus 1 you can write this as x y z plus X is it. So the option is B. Now question number 22. If X dollar Y is defined as 2 into X plus Y whole square, then what is the value of 2 dollar 3? Here the dollar indicates binary operation. So in place of X put 2 sorry in place of x put 2 in place of y put 3 here then 2 dollar 3 equal here this is a 2 into x is 2 and plus y is 3 the whole square which is equal 2 into 2 plus 3 is 5 square 5 square is 25 into 2 is 50 so option C now next problem if x comma y comma and z are real numbers which is always true here the first choice is x into yz equal xy into z here first option is possible means take one number so x equal to 2 y equal to 4 and z equal to 5 now x y z so which gives x is 2 and y z y is z is 4 into y which is equal x y 2 into 4 into 5 here which use 4 into 5 is 20 20 into 2 is 40 here 2 into 4 is 8 8 into 5 is 40 here the second choice is here not possible check here x over y is 2 over 4 is equal 4 over 5 which is not equal so choice 2 is not possible only the choice 2 is possible when x y z are in arithmetic progression that is 2 4 6 or 1 2 3 like but third option is possible here z first third option is z is y x plus y 2 plus 4 equal x is z x is 2 into 5 z is 5 plus z y z is 5 and y is 4 here this is 2 plus 4 is 6 6 into 5 is 30 here 2 5 is are 10 plus 5 4 is are 20 and 30 equal to 30 so it is okay means here this third choice is always possible and one 
first choice is always possible so here one and two only the choice is one and three only sorry choice is d now next question if y equal to 6, po 6 power x then 6y is equal here y equal 6 power x then 6y equal 6 into 6 power x 6 can be written as 6 power 1 so it is equal 6 power x plus 1 so choice b then what is the smallest of six consecutive odd integers whose average that is arithmetic mean is x plus 2 here suppose we are keeping these options are first numbers of the consecutive odd integers suppose here x plus y next is this x plus y is smallest suppose x minus 3 x minus 1 then x plus 1 adding 2's everywhere x plus 3 and x plus 5 here yeah, 1 2 3 4 5 one more number is x plus 7 here that addition is 6x and uh, addition of the number is minus 4 plus 4 is cut and 12 that is here total is 6x plus 12 here 6x plus 12 if you divide by 6 means arithmetic mean which gives 6 bracket x plus 2 factorizing by 6 is that so here x plus 2 is our arithmetic mean so not x plus 2 we have to do with x minus 5 also so this means this x plus 7 is not there we have already x minus 5 x plus 1 2 3 4 5 6 so addition of minus 5 minus 3 is minus 8 minus 9 here plus 9 so answer is only 6x 6x divided by 6 is x only it's not x plus 2 so first option is not there second here x minus 3 x minus 1 and x plus 1 x plus 3 adding to everywhere x plus 5 we have 1 2 3 4 5 next is x plus 7 add minus 1 plus 1 is 0 3 plus 5 is 8 8 plus 7 is 15 so it is not uh, giving average of x plus 2 that means next one is x minus 1 x plus 1 adding to x plus 3 x plus 5 x plus 7 1 2 3 4 5 and x plus 9 so here minus 1 plus 1 is 0 3 plus 5 is 8 8 plus uh, 7 is 15 15 plus 8 is 23 it will not give the average of x plus 2 x also will check it x plus 2 x plus 5 x plus 7 x plus 9 x plus 11 that is 1 2 3 4 5 6 so of course it will not give means 2 plus 5 is 7 14 23 23 plus uh, 34 it will not give that x plus 2 that last option is uh, first is x plus 1 second is x minus 1 adding to I'm sorry x plus 3 x plus 1 that is x plus 3 x plus y x plus 7 x plus 9 9 and uh, x plus 11 1 2 3 4 5 6 so this will not give that uh, mean is uh, x plus 2 so our uh, here check with the 
here x minus here take, take one more time here here minus 3 minus or minus 5 minus minus 8 minus 9 minus is minus 9 plus c is uh, 9 it will not be there second one is minus 3 minus 4 first one is minus 3 plus 3 cut the second option is here it is giving 6x plus 12 check one more time x minus 3 minus 1 is minus 4 plus 1 is minus 3 plus 3 is 0 5 plus 7 is 12 so 6x plus 12 over 6 because mean is gives x plus 2 so our uh, option b is correct now the product of a and b is equal to 11 more than that twice the sum of a and b the product of a and b is a b is is equal to 11 more than more than the twice the addition of twice the sum of a and b plus 11 11 more here already the b value is given so b is 7 that is a b is 7 a 2 into a b is 7 that is a plus 7 plus 11 so 7 a equal 2 a plus 14 plus 11 that is 7 a equal 2 a plus 25 therefore 7a minus uh, 2a equal 25 that is 5a equal 25 a equal 25 over 5 that is uh, 5 now what is the value of b minus a so we, a we got as 5 therefore b minus a that is a b is 7 already given 7 minus 5 equal to 2 so our option is a rest of the problem we will continue in next videos we have done please subscribe our youtube channel